What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. A new Tyler Perry movie just dropped. I have to say this guy's doing really well. No matter what you think of him, his movies. I knew him since the play days. Do we call it plays? The theatre play days when he was putting on a show and stuff like that and they had to sing in and all that. I think since then I've kind of dipped out of his content but I still respect him. I still respect what he does. Obviously, controversy around he's dressing like a woman, all that good stuff. But I think since he evolved out of that, I'm not sure if he's still doing it. From what I can see, he's not. I think now he's just making movies, which is actually, I think, is fantastic. Coming out of, I guess, grinding, for lack of a better word. And now he's a full-fledged producer, has his own studio, blah, blah, blah. So I respect the hustle and I respect what he did. When we're talking about his faith, that's a different issue. I don't know, neither here or there. I don't know. I can't judge him. I don't know what it is. I know people have a lot to say about his faith. I don't know much about the guy. I just respect his hustle. I respect what he did. I liked him from the very beginning, from the humble beginning. Because of that, I respect where he is now. But I do have to say, uh, my wife watched all his other ones. I don't think I've watched all the kind of, you know, the most popular one, like the Diary of the Mad Black Woman, all that stuff. I really never got into those ones. I don't think I've watched, maybe I have watched it with the lady and I, it just wasn't memorable. But yeah, I don't recall the, that era of his movie. But his newest ones are, you know, movies that I've been quite interested in, especially that he's um, kind of upped his game. Like he's doing really well. Anyway, let's check out his new movie which is coming out on prime it's called divorce in black or divorce in the black or something like that guys before i check out this trailer please leave a like comment and subscribe to my channel i really appreciate you guys watching my video help me get to that 1000 sub so i can become a youtube member let's get into it wow thank you for inviting us we actually used to come here all the time right thomas you don't hear her talking to you you better get your wife man Ain't nobody oh, gonna get me. Let's just order. I just want to have a nice night. I don't know how you do it, Ava. Oh, see, she tells you everything, huh? Dallas. Let's go. You know what? I can't do this. Wait, isn't what that... Looking at? Isn't that one of the Mary Mary husband? I think. I'm not sure. I'm not sure, guys. You are home now, and you are safe. Oh, she's divorced now, yeah? I tried everything. No peace to be found. You have taught me since I was a little girl oh, to be a good sorry, wife. Oh, sorry, You think he's gonna make up? Stop! That boy, put his hands on you! Is that her dad? But what happens when that's not enough? Sometimes we hold on to the things that God himself wants us to let go of. I didn't realize how deep in the red I was. When this divorce is over, I want to be in the black. Girl, you got that man out of your house? What does that mean? Celebrate, get you a new man. I am not even thinking about that. Honestly, I never oh, liked the way he she meets another guy. I always thought you were too good for him. And then he comes after him. Probably one of those obsessed movies. Yep, it is. Let's go. Aren't you glad to see me? He's in your house. I didn't go to looking old. I gave though. up so much of myself to be with you. But you haven't met the real me. Okay, so that's the divorce thing for this year. Yeah. Stop repeating. He walked inside your house and now he's sitting outside the bank? Ava, you need a restraint. Yeah, yeah, this is the obsessed, obsessed guy. I'm going to tell you this just one time. Me. You better leave me alone. Ooh. I heard gone. I'm not sure Ooh. Careful pushing a good woman too far. And then what? Divorce in the black. What does the black mean? I don't understand. No light in the dark. July, okay. Alright guys, what does the does the in the black mean anything specific or is it just black as in race, as in divorce in a black, I guess, marriage? I don't know. But it is an interesting movie to talk about we know the premise so depending on how it goes i really like the question that was asked there which is she was raised to be a good wife but what happens when it, when that in itself is not enough which is what i talk about a lot in 
my relationship channel guys go check it out i'll put it on the screen right now go over there and check out my videos over there but it's interesting because we have a question here where a woman got married did what she was meant to do but unfortunately she ended up with the wrong man or with an abusive man or with a, a wicked man what we would say in our faith as christians what, what happens then what does she do it's very very interesting of course my answer to that is most times you can minimize ending up with a wicked man by being a little bit wise surrounding yourself with wise people there's been a lot of people who got married to people when the elders for lack of a better word or the people over them were like look listen this guy ain't no good this guy ain't no good but because of love you know you're in love they marry anyway and then tragedy so a lot of times that happens a lot of times you're i'm not saying all the time but i think majority of the time that tends to be the case but just mostly in general don't be blinded by love this is why the bible talks about in the multitude of counsel there's wisdom or there's safety in other words if you get counseled if you get advice from people which a lot of young people are not doing these days or if they are they're listening to the wrong people you know online and stuff like that but in the multitude of counsel you find safety it means you can avoid certain things be that as it may if you do end up there what do you do that is a very interesting question especially for a christian young lady in my opinion when it comes to cheating or domestic violence i think <laughs> but that's my thing i don't think any man should be putting his hands on any woman i don't think you know you should be cheating if you've married this person you shouldn't be having sex anywhere else so that's my thing but that's by the by guys i don't want to use this trailer reaction to give advice on relationships go over to my relationship channel check out some, some of my videos there i'm definitely going to check out this trailer uh, it looks good he's got some big names in there he's got megan goods of course as the face of the movie so we're gonna watch it i'm gonna watch it with the lady i'm probably gonna come back with a review it's on prime so you know we can watch it when it drops let me know what you think in the comments below guys what are your thoughts on tyler perry what are your thoughts on these movies remember to give me a like comment and sub on this video until next time guys i'll see you on my next reaction